Traveling to Disney, I'm going to tell you how to get around Disney once you get there. Did you know that Disney has multiple ways of getting around, multiple um, ways of transporting yourself from A to B? And the first way of getting around is your standard bus. The, um, the buses around Disney are free, as is all the other transportation. Uh, you can get a bus from the resorts and it will take you to the parks. You can get buses from the parks to the resorts. You can get buses at Disney Springs and that will take you to all the different resort areas and to the parks. Um, and one of the resorts, which is the campgrounds, it is such a big area. They actually have buses within the campgrounds to take you to all the different areas within the campgrounds because the, um, the land mass there is pretty big. So uh, yeah, so buses are your way around from resorts to parks and parks to resorts. And again, it's all free. And uh, there are terminals that are at most of the parks. And there are signs that will show you which uh, bus to get on. So there's, you don't need maps, you don't need schedules. It's just all there. Most buses come every, I, I think every 10 minutes, they're pretty fast. Um, so yeah, so it's, it's great, um, very convenient. And um, yeah, it's, it's fantastic and it's free. Yeah, the next mode of transportation is fairly new. I was so excited because when we were there last time at Disney, they were just starting to build the whole um, transportation system called the Skyliner, which is all gondolas that takes you all around the, the resorts that are attached to Epcot and Hollywood Studios. Yeah. Welcome aboard. We're up in the Disney Skyliner. Skyliner. And Disney Hollywood Studios. We're at Hollywood Studios. We are yep. on our way to Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort with connecting flight to Epcot International Gateway. Disney's Pop Century Resort. Now please goodbye to your joint hands. Bye. 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 Hollywood Studios. Say, like, Tower of Terror. It doesn't look that busy, but then like the parking lot goes away. There. <laughs> yeah. We're heading over to Caribbean Beach. Yep. Get off there. See it's way over there. there. I've waited three years to do this. <laughs> At least. Yay! I don't know what we got. Uh, nothing. Nothing? We got a nothing? Oh, of course. We're just in, a in just a few moments. We will be traveling over See every that one doesn't have anybody on it. <laughs> Got pirates up there. Ooh, Nemo. finding Nemo. Is there nobody like us? We're nobody. Ooh. Coco. Woo! Nobody. Beauty and the Beast, Numenere. Did you know that the entire Walt Disney World Resort is over 40 square miles? That's about the same size as the city of San Francisco and double the island of Manhattan. Monsters Inc. 50. Oh. Haunted Mansion. Haunted Mansion. Another 50th. We will be arriving at Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort shortly. All passengers must disembark and transfer at this station. Thank you. And we hope you enjoyed the oh, most I magical the flight on Earth. Peter Pan, coming in. Ah! <laughs> We're landing at Caribbean Beach. Please remain seated until the doors automatically open. When exiting the cabin, please supervise children. 
There's the other rail line over there. Oh, and another one going that way. But there's three different lines, I believe. Here we come. Coming in hot. Coming in hot. Ah! <laughs> Another form of transportation around Disney is the boats. Boats. Some of the resorts, um, from resort to resort, to resort to Magic Kingdom. Right now, the boats to Contemporary and campgrounds are not running. Hopefully they bring them back, because that was a lot of fun going from the, the different resorts to the campgrounds um, and vice versa. A little boat will take us over to Magic Kingdom. Watch your step. I'm on board. Go to Magic Kingdom. Yep. Watch your ears. <laughs> Yay! Oh, our first boat ride of this trip. Yay! This is Bay Lake. Cottages at um, Wilderness Lodge. Waterway coming up here is actually a bridge going over the main road coming into Disney. Uh.
right here is the bridge, the waterway over the main road. If you could stand up, you could actually see the road down there. See the cars. The open air boats compared to the closed in boat. Coming up on Floridian over there, Polynesian is over there. You can see Space Mountain, Cinderella's Castle. Just beautiful. Okay. Good view of Polynesian over there. <laughs> Better view of Floridian. We're coming into the main docks at Magic Kingdom. Oh, there's the big ferry boat. The big ferry boat takes you from Magic Kingdom over to the uh, main parking lot. We haven't done that in a long time because we really like going on the monorail. <laughs> from Wilderness Lodge, you can get a boat from Contemporary and to take you over to, oh actually I don't know that you can actually get a boat to Contemporary right now because the guy said the main dock is down to Contemporary. But normally you can get it from Campgrounds, you can get it from Contemporary and you can get the boat from Wilderness Lodge normally. And there's also a boat from Floridian over and a boat over from the main parking lot. And I believe there's boats from Polynesian, if you want to do that. So here we come to the main dock at Magic Kingdom. station at uh, Magic Kingdom. It doesn't look very busy at Magic Kingdom today. And it's a Saturday, but it's also 2 o'clock in the afternoon. So. And here we are.
runs on magnets, right, Steve? It's magnetic monorails? No? It does not run on magnets. <laughs> I thought it did. Here you go. Monorail. Ticket Transportation Center. Love the monorail. It's like it's not, you don't arrive at Disney until you're actually on the monorail. The, um, the boat also goes from the French Quarter at Port Orleans. You can get the boat from Port Orleans to French Quarter. You can get the boat at Riverside at Port Orleans and that will take you between the two resorts and it will take you on a really nice, probably 20 minute, 15 minute boat ride up to Disney Springs, which is the shop shopping district. Well, I hope that helped you understand a little bit about Disney transportation. I uh, hope that gave you some ideas and what you can do. And hopefully when you go on your next trip to Disney, you can use some of these suggestions. Remember, we've got monorails, boats, uh, gondolas in the sky. Um, yeah, all kinds of fun stuff. And there's also walking and driving. Walking is great. But that's another whole video.